What is going on everybody? What are we looking at here today? We are looking at a game called Prehistoric Isle in 1930, brought to us by SNK of America. And also, I want to remind you, winners, do not use drugs. Be a winner, don't use drugs. But what does this look like here, boys and girls? This looks like a side-scrolling shooter with power-ups and pickups. And it looks like it supports two players simultaneous. And the best part of all is that it has dinosaurs. I love dinosaurs. And look at this thing here. This reminds me of Caveman Ninja a little bit, you know? Uh, very, very cool. Look at that dinosaur, too. It's a Brachiosaurus. Wow. I mean, you know, Brachiosauruses are known for their evil distemper, sharp teeth, and, um, and habits of attacking planes. So, Credits zero, insert coin, prehistoric aisle in 1930. Look at that dinosaur. Oh my goodness. Copyright 1989 from SNK. How about we stick a coin in here? Let's hit one player start. And let's, during the 1930s, there have been many shipwrecks. Okay. I can't read that that quickly. All right. There have been many shipwrecks. We are going to do an inquiry on the forest. Okay. Okay, is there, there's only one button. And it doesn't look like I can uh, rapid fire by holding it down, I have to button mash. Okay, it's looking like if I shoot an egg, I get a pickup. It also looks like if I hit one of these pterodactyls, um, I die. So I shoot an egg, okay, this is a power up. Okay, now I can change the direction of the power up. Okay, that's cool. Okay, shoot down. That's so cool that depending on which way you angle it, it does different things. That's very, very cool. I like that feature. Caveman. Caveman. Onk. Oh, dude, I just got blowed up. So, yeah, I'm an, I'm an old biplane. Old biplane, airplane. Okay, here's my shoot 'em up. Okay, I like that. I can shoot as fast as I can tap that button, it'll shoot too. Money. Okay, now I need to be going up. I love the music too. Oh my goodness, there's so much stuff on the screen here. It's impossible to keep track of it all. All right, well, I came in rank of three. I died. Can I put in another quarter and continue? Yes, I can. You can continue right where you left off. That is a cool feature. I like that feature. Okay. I like the ricochet shots. You basically have to look out for all the dinosaurs on the screen. They tend to not um, like you and want to do you harm. Okay, he's dropping some type. Oh, he's dropping more baby uh, birds. Okay. Okay, now I want to be shooting down. Oh, dude. Can you give me a power up? Now you're just money. Okay, this guy here looks like a Mario Brothers dude. Okay, I don't know what S gives me. Is S just money? Okay, I think I've made it to a boss. Caution, it's the Brachiosaurus! Okay, it's time to button mash, boys and girls. We are button- oh, crap. Oh, I banged my frickin' microphone, too. Sorry about that. Okay, I'm button mashing. Man, he just reaches right out and gets me, don't he? Oh, do I want to continue? Yes, let's continue. This is recrazyless. Re recrazyless. Redonculous. Recrazyless. Man, he just gets me. What is a poor biplane to do from this evil Brachiosaurus? I guess you gotta duck right before he lunges forward, huh? When he lunges forward, he's fixing to get you. Alright, I took him out. Wow. Holy crap. And more birds just attacking me. And more birds attacking me. Holy crap. Well, I guess that was my initials. 
Continue. Alright. I don't know what I just did there. I put my initials in somewhere. Now, what's the deal with the water? Can I go through the water? Okay, I guess I can. Okay. Oh, don't bump into the eggs, though. Caveman! Captain Caveman! An extra power-up pickup thingy. I don't know what those things do. Those things are weird. I'm really trying to figure out what the heck I should be doing here with that power gun. It's a funky thing. Oh, crap. He hit me. It's an Allosaurus. Caution. Caution. There's my initials. A, 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 A. Let's continue. Okay. Another boss. The dreaded Allosaurus boss. Okay. Oh, wow. He can jump and do all kinds of stuff. So, yeah, this game screams co-op. Bombing the crap out of you, sucker. Oh, did he blow up my super gun? Dude. Oh my god, this guy is just killing me. Oh man, this is a hard freaking game. This game was designed to suck the money out of you. Okay. I guess I just finished one of those inquiries. Alright. Pretty cool, though. Right, great graphics, great color, great music, great use of scrolling and sprites and all that kind of stuff. This is what you went to the arcade for, was to get a high-quality experience. To get graphics and sound and gameplay that often just wasn't quite able to be done at home. You know, it's kind of like the difference between watching a movie at home and watching a movie in the theater. There was just something about the experience of playing the real game on the real machine. It was more authentic, it was more enjoyable. There was a social element to being out of the house and being at the arcade, the competitive element. So, um, you know, arcades were awesome. And the games were awesome. They were. Okay, this is a Ramaphosaurus. What the hell is he doing? He's got some type of water thing he's shooting at me. Okay, and I'm not doing any damage to this guy here. His golden health bar is still very health healthy. Oh, crap. Continue. Drop in some quarters. Crap on a stick. Holy crap, I just got blown up by water. Frickin' typhoons. Okay, you've got to have... The super gun. Fight these yo-yos. That's not a super gun. Oh, the typhoon got me. Oh, okay. It just got me, but it didn't kill me. Oh, okay. That time it lured me to my death. Okay, give me my super gun, bro. Okay. His health bar hasn't changed, no matter what I do to this guy. He is a tough dude to get, man. This Rhinosaurus, whatever the heck he is. Okay, now his bar is going down. He's actually lost exactly one square from that golden health bar. Oh, crap. Dude, you're killing me, bro. I'll bomb your butt. Bombing. Is bombing doing any good? Not really. Okay, he's down to one bar. Can I take him out? Can I take this sucker out? I need another gun. I got him. Blowed him up. Yes. For the win. <laughs> On the ground. Oh my god. Cavemen being carried by bats. Not cool. Continue. 
I like a game that you can just keep continuing. I love the music. These guys are just everywhere trying to get me, bro. You're trying to get me, bro. Oh, dude. Those bats are hard to kill, man. Cavemen. Angry cavemen, no less. Why are you so angry, bro? Okay, give me a gun. I don't want points, I want guns. Ah. My god. Look at that thing there. Holy crap. Oh, I got blown up right when I was getting my gun, man. How not cool is that? Oh, look at this guy here. He looks cool. Dude, these guys are redonkulous. These guys are redonkulous. Just blowing me up there. Caution! Another boss. Oh, what the heck is this guy here? He looks really freaky. Unknown dinosaur. He's unknown. Spitting fire. That's kind of not cool, bro. Unknown dinosaur. Doing a lot of known damage to me, though. I need this gun, bro. It's not a gun. Dang it. Oh my god. Come on. Give me a gun. Give me a gun. Am I even hurting him? Am I doing any damage to this guy? I need to put some more coins in here now. My god, man. That's a gun. Okay. That gun's doing a little bit of damage. Okay. I got the unknown dinosaur. Woohoo! Oh, and it just the action keeps going. Let's just keep on going, bro. Oh, you cannot bump into those eggs, man. Even though they're technically a pickup, you can't bump into them until you crack them. Oh, God. This is insane. Look at this guy here. What are you, bro? You are absolutely insane. And I want you to die. You too, cave dudes. I don't care if you are my ancestor. Oh, what is this? Oh, so now we got bad guys coming out of the water. So you... Ah, dude. Love the percussion sounds. This music is really good. I'm gonna have to look for this soundtrack. Prehistoric Isle. Good soundtrack. Rockin' soundtrack, man. You guys, man. You guys, you freaking guys. Last credit. Alright. Oh my god. Dude, you sucked me in. That's not cool. Oh, okay. Well, that's it. That's it. All right. I have been playing Prehistoric Isle 1930. I would say this is an awesome game. I will say it. I'm going to go on record and say this. Years. Yeah, this is an awesome game. And remember, kids, winners don't use drugs. But SNK presents... Prehistoric Isle. Look at this thing. Look at that dinosaur. Prehistoric Isle in Ooh, excuse me. Prehistoric Isle in 1930, brought to us in 1984 by S N 
Okay, look at these levels. This game would be a lot more funnerer if I had another player to play with me. I will probably get Megan to join me in this because this reminds me of Caveman Ninja a little bit, but it's harder. And she enjoyed playing that game with me. But this was cool. This was fun. I hope you enjoyed this preview. I have been the original gamer, Stevie Stroh. This has been Prehistoric Isle. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a like. Give it a big fat thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. If you have something you'd like to say, throw out a comment and let me hear it. I'd also appreciate it if you could share this video. Share my channel with your friends. If you like old school games, there's plenty more on my channel. Check them out. I got all kinds of games. Old school, new school, middle school, high school. Preschool, you name it, I got it. Thank you for watching. Peace out, game on people, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.